Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wogan. I'm back with another Dragalia Lost video. Today, I'm finally going to be doing a video on Galanaut because I was able to sparking her and I'm not busy anymore with all of the crazy things that are going on. With April Fool's Day, trying to summon Fidel for Videl, which if you play Dokkan, a video of that will be up later today, I think. I'm, I'm busy, it's a busy time. Busy time. So yeah, this is Galanaut. Um, I have her. I've been using her. She's fun. Let's get into it. If you end up liking this video, you can leave a like, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff. It's very supportive. I've been getting a lot of support uh, because of this uh, Annie, and I thank everyone who does it. So let's go in here. As always, I'm going to do it in the three places I usually do it. <laughs> that sounded wrong. I, I, <laughs> I was like, hmm. Didn't think about that with her. I did not think that with her. So we'll go into Merkel. I have um, basically been using this to farm Celia. Um, this team to farm Celia, so I'm very interested in this myself to see how they do. Uh, I already kind of know how Galanaut plays. I'll, if you're not aware, this is how she plays. She plays like uh, Wolverine doing Berserker Claw from Marvel vs. Capcom. Because... <laughs> Actually, let me see on times 3 speed how she looks. <laughs> she looks so fast. She looks like she's like on all of the drugs as she just goes and then she goes huge and she goes whoa oh, yeah, and she smacks him in the face all right let's slow down all right now we're going here now the one thing that i actually do not like about galanaut it's the one thing if she is not the main unit she will not transform into big knot which is a shame because as i'm going to show right here um other units have their dragon so i don't know why she doesn't get her that same thing that Nott has. It's kind of crazy to me. Um, go back to her. Go here. It's not the biggest thing in the world, but it is something that I was like, oh, that's kind of annoying. Let me go here. As you can see here, she gets insane hits on everything she does. Uh, she's going full on hype. She has this little mini tornado, which really helps with everything. And of course, her giant form just deals so much. T Did she call her Mega Nott? That's funny. Everyone's been calling her hot, which is uh, appropriate for how she looks, but her, for her to call her Mega Knot is pretty funny. So I don't think I'm going to be able to beat this just because of this stupid fight. I don't know why. Um, it's I've always had trouble with it with win. I assume it's because I need to use more units at buff. Um, uh, specifically wind, but it's never enough damage. So it's not a testament to how she does. This is just literally me with Fafnir. I've been beefing with Fafnir on specifically Win for an extremely long time. I could probably get rid of Loen, to be honest. But I've beaten it before. That's not the main focus here. I just wanted to show up Gala, not specific combos and stuff. If I wanted to beat, uh... I mean, I don't have to prove myself to you. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just joking around. I've beaten it before. With a diff What team did I even beat it with, actually? Let me go back. Because I totally did beat it. But I wonder with what? What was the difference? Alright, let me see. I'll prove my worth. There yet. you go. This was the team. That was the difference maker. No healers on that team either. That's the main difference with dealer, I guess. Alright, that's enough joking around. Let's go into an actual fight. This is the wrong fight. Let's go into No, it was the right fight. It was the right fight. We don't have time to do Mercury, I think? We don't have- well, it doesn't matter, it's not open. We can just do here. Quickly whip some ass. Shouldn't be a problem. This team, um, obviously not the- This current- the team, the way- the reason that the team is built the way it is is just because it's with wind units I think are really fun to use. Um, I really like Galanaut's specific animations and stuff. She's a really fun dagger. I'm glad that they made her dagger and not sword. Um... Galaluka, not Galaluka, just, um, is it Festival Yukata you Yeah, Yukata Luka. Um, they, he basically serves the same purpose as uh, Galanaut in terms of debuffing, so they don't really need to be on the same team, but I do like his, um, hammer, which is really funny to look at for me. Um, so that's why he's on the team. I don't know why I activated that. There was no reason for me to. It's a literally literal force of habit. Jesus, she does so much. Mega Knot. Okay, hot. 
Mercury should not be able to live very much longer. Um, and Galaranzel is here because Galaranzel is also really fun to use. At some point, someone asked I should do a showcase on Galaranzel. I've never done one because when Galaranzel released, he was not very good. But maybe in the future I will do one. Especially since I've been working on my win team pretty fiercely the past couple days. There you go. Fairy power. Um, let's go here. I wish Gala, when she turns into uh, Giant Knot, aka Hot, aka maybe not based on what not Knot's own shell. Um, Jesus, that was just a complete wash. I didn't even come close to losing this. Poor Mercury. At one point, you were very tough. Huh. She was awesome. I wish there was a different animation for if you were a huge, uh, huge knot at there at the end. All right, let's move on and into the final testing area. Now I have beaten it. I, I should probably show that I've beaten it with. I think it was the last team I used was this one to beat it. So not to say that like obviously like oh if you use this team you'll be able to beat it 100. percent That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying I think I was able to I'm beat it with this team. Yeah, 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 I was. She fights for her friends. I confirmed for Fire Emblem 3. Let's go into Expert. That's why I'm one. Uh, what was I gonna talk about before I completely freaking blanked out on everything? Good job, OBS. Good job completely missing all that, so I have to... One moment. Okay, hold up. Uh, so I got OBS working again. I need to replay that retry. Because this is maybe the... Dragalia, what the hell are you doing with this? What are you doing? I'm gonna play complete silence. Please. No talk. No way! Does this mean I'm useless? And... Uh, th there's a lot of good lines for when you lose, specifically. I didn't hear her say that during Merkel at all. I wonder why. Uh, maybe I was just too busy. Anyway, let's go beat up this bunny woman real quick. I've been also playing a little bit of Legend Celia just to get the feel of how she gets to it. And her second phase is just... I got the first one completely down pat, except for some specific things. But man, this fight... There we go. Ow. Of course, you hit me right on... It's fine. Big Knot. But yeah, I really like this knot. I think she's really fun to play. I'm not 100% sure. I like her co-op ability to go with Gala Ranzel as like a side unit on the side. Um, the only thing, again, the only negative I have about her is specifically not being able to go into this huge knot uh, when she's not the main uh, person in control. I don't understand. Apparently, that that's a, apparently Tiki is one of the few to Tiki and the Persona users because um, other units with the Dragon Drive aren't able to do it. Um, like. Galena, if she's not in the first slot, she will transform, I think. Which I've never noticed that. That seems weird to me. There she goes, she goes big. Um, I don't know why they do that. I don't know why Tiki got such special treatment. It, I don't understand why they chose to put Maker this way, but it's fine. Because again, if you could use two in auto, it'd be amazing. But you can't, which is a shame. Okay, we go. Come on, slap her up. I'm pretty sure she's pretty close to dying. No, she's not. <laughs> she's nowhere close to dying. She's close to a break, though. Oh, I hate bolts from the That's the one thing the Legends fight of this has taught me is that I hate bolts from above. I hate anything that, that makes me stop attacking. Smack him. Smack him around, girl. She's like nowhere close to losing this giant form, by the way. It's kind of amazing. She's just like walloping on her non-stop. She might lose it here finally because of the frigid beam stuff. Bam, bam. But it she didn't. Wow, that's insane. I guess I understand now why they don't <laughs> let the side character turn into her because... Yeah, get it, Luca. Oh. Yeah. Hurrah. You are awesome. So that's Galanaut. Um, in terms of the sparking characters that I've been forced to do, um, 
she's my favorite sparking so far no thank you no need for the weekly bonus um she's a ton of fun to play i really like her fast combo i think she's a pretty good mixture of even if she can't go into her giant form in the um when she's the side unit she still has pretty good dispelling which is very nice to have um she can as always go between big and small whenever she wants um i just really like her she's really fun again i think she's a good versatility between being a good unit and being an extremely fun unit sometimes you have extremely fun units that aren't good and no we went yeah you have extremely fun units that aren't good and then extremely good units that are boring to play as and i think she's a perfect mix of not so amazing that she is automatically the thing that you should always get i think she would actually be in my mind if i were to rank specifically the gala wins it would probably be ranzel number one then her number two uh in terms of fun playing i would put not number one <laughs> in front of ranzel but that's me personally um and then in terms of the, I guess, you know, Zephyr, Zephyr is not fair because Zephyr is, I guess Zephyr is actually number one, right? Because every single wind unit uses Zephyr, <laughs> so it would go Zephyr, <laughs> the Ranzel and Not in my mind together, even though I think um, Ranzel does way more DPS than Not does. Um, yeah, she, I think he really does. He's kind of crazy sick amazing and then from there it's the rest of them uh which i think is just leaf actually i can look right here man i can look at all the wind agitos because i have them all yeah leaf man what happened to you man you were so amazing the problem was is that leaf is still very good the problem is is that look at this murder's row of four swords you have Morgana, you have Ranzel, you have Hope. That's the problem, is that here's where all the problems started. It's the fact that Hope is also sword. It just causes too much troubles. Midgar's almost also good. I need to remember to do a video on him. But anyway, that's the end of today's video, everyone. I hope you liked it. If you're still listening to me ramble here at the end, that means you must really like me. Show that like by leaving a like. And if you have not subscribed to me, go ahead and leave a subscription and a comment, whatever you want. And I'll see you guys in the next video. You guys have a good night and i'll see you in the next adventure one day i'm gonna remember perfectly to just always say that at the end <laughs>